They say that life is a journey with its ups and downs and unexpected twists. The thing about life though is that it can be awfully unpredictable. In a single moment, things can go from according to plan to something completely unexpected. I always pitied those who had to start over, but I never thought it'd be me. Mom, I've already told you, I don't wanna have this discussion anymore. I'm sick of having the same conversation over and over. The decision's already been made. I'm not gonna have this child. Why? Because it's my decision. I'm sick of you and everyone else trying to tell me what to do. Stop trying to control me. Are you all right? No. I'm... I'm pregnant. I'm sorry, I can't really say it out loud. My mom wants me to keep the baby, which is a complete accident. I swear, I never should have told her. I mean, I have so much on my plate already with, with this internship coming up and, and four classes and work. This is my time to focus on me, my future, and build a life that I'm proud of. She just, she just doesn't understand that. But with this internship, I know that I can show her that I'm good at what I do. This is my chance to prove it to everyone. What about their future? Who? Theirs. No, I don't. This is not what I need right now. I'm not what they need. I understand. But you said you wanted a chance to prove yourself. Don't you think your child deserves that chance too? I mean, God's given you a gift. Gift? He's the reason for all this mess. I've worked day and night, sometimes without sleep, and this is what happens to me? You know, I know that they say God is good, but I, I just, I don't see it. Not having a pregnancy would be better for their sake and for mine. I was supposed to have a baby. Her name was Rebecca. I had always wanted a child of my own. And so when I, I would see the ultrasound, I, it was like I was seeing my own heart. I was so excited to call her Becky. What happened? She died before she ever got to see our faces. God doesn't do things to hurt you. He does things to shape you for a purpose that we are incapable of understanding. When no one else is there and you're on the bathroom floor feeling like the world is closing in on you, feeling nothing but the pain of the love that was there but now it's not anymore and and somehow he's the one holding you through it all. I, I, I didn't know he did all that. God does a lot of things that we can't see. How do you know that he's there? Faith, Hannah. Faith. I never told you my name. No. But God did. He wants me to tell you that he sees you, Hannah. He sees both of you. And he has given you a choice. But know that he's chosen the both of you to be together for a purpose. You would have made a great mom. <laughs> I know I will be. Because God keeps his promises. Hey. Mom, I'm sorry that I hung up on you. And I shouldn't have yelled. Um, I just, I wanted to tell you something. I'm not ready to have this baby yet, but I know that God is with me. And I can't do this alone. So will you help me? 